District 2 District Swimming from Bowling Green State University. And this is the 200 freestyle race. Grace Rhodes from Wauseon finishing in second place, getting the automatic bid to state with a time of 2.02.39. Third and sixth place is also from Wauseon. Cameo Cedarly from Minster finishing in seventh. This is a 200 IM with Marissa Beckett with the close second place finish and a 2.13.26. She's going to state. Peyton Methley from Bath finished in sixth place. In the 50 free, it's Napoleon's Kaylee Nagel with an impressive 23.63 for a first place finish. Tegan Fort Camp of Fort Recovery finishing in sixth place. In the 100 fly, first and second place are both from this region. Elizabeth Threshold from Archbold, first place finish in a time of 58.45. Macy May of Coldwater, 58.47. They're both going to state. Shawnee's Katie Phillips finished in ninth place. The 100 free and it's Kaylee Nagel again coming in with another first place finish, this time with 100 free, 52.29. Bath's Peyton Methley finished in eighth. Emma Guggenbiller from Salina finished in ninth. In the 500, it was a race to the finish and a come from behind finish for the second place state bid for Magdalena Duden of Wauseon with the 526.72 Kensington Cup from Ottawa Glendorf in seventh. This is the 100 breaststroke and you're watching Sierra Rupert, the freshman from St. Mary's. She would finish second in this heat third place overall waiting to see if she will time in for state she had a great time of 108.06 remember you can check swimmeet.com for a complete list of the finishers and the state qualifiers now on to some of the boys qualifiers in the 200 yard medley relay wapakoneta finishes in third place in this race but would get first place in the 200 freestyle relay qualifying for state in the 200 freestyle it's napoleon's kyle hudson fin finishing in first place with a time of 140.81 tying the district record set last year. He also got first place in the 100 free. Kellen Rigg of Bryan, second place in the 200 free, first place in the 500. In the 50 free, it's Alex Honigfort, the sophomore from Wapakoneta, finishing in first place, heading back to state. His time was 21.66. He got second in the 100 free. So both of those events, he is headed to state in. And in the 100 fly, John Briggs will finish in third place in this race, hoping to time in. But he got second place in the 100 back, so he is heading to state for sure in the 100 backstroke. Don't forget, you can go to swimmeet.com for all the results and all of the state qualifiers. I'm Jennifer Beck for the Sports Report.